a Saturday evening and I just got home from Sam's. We did a pretty big haul, I think. We've restocked meat for our freezer and other household items that we needed to stock up on. Large haul, but it costs more than it looks, I think. So I've got prices written on everything and I've got a total for the end of the video. So let's get into it and see what we got. Okay guys, so there's my haul. There's also another cube of Dr. Pepper down in the floor and two boxes of uh, Gold Peak Sweet Tea for Brent. I just didn't feel like lifting them up on the table, honestly. I'm just worn out. Um, all right, so this is a big, a pretty big haul. Prices are high and um, that's all I can say, but I was glad to get the meat that I found. So let's go around the table and I'll show you what I got. This is my ice water here. All right, I got three packages of hamburger. Each package was approximately five pounds and I paid $3.98 a pound, so $19.86. I got a total of 15 pounds. All right, more meat. I got a pork loin, $1.98 a pound, and this is 8.44 pounds. So I paid $16.74 for this. I will divide this up into pork chops, pork roast, sweet and sour pork, barbecue, all, all the things. So I love to get a pork loin. Also found a beef roast for three, three ninety-eight a pound. It looks really nice. I paid a total of $15 for that. And I will get at least three or four meals out of that. Try to get more than that. All right, chicken breast, boneless, skinless chicken breast. <laughs> I was not happy. The price was $3 a pound. Actually, that's really strange because it said $3, but here it says price per pound is $2.68, 5.98 pounds. My total price was $13.03. The sticker price says $16.03, but on my register receipt, they did take $3 off of each package for instant savings. And it's good until it says to sell by January 17th. So I got two packages of those. So that's a great deal. Um, on around the table, that's all I got as far as meat goes. I got the Nature Valley Sweet and Salty Bars. That's like a grab and go breakfast. They, not too long ago, were $7 and something a box. Tonight they were $12.14. There are 36 bars in there. But wow, prices do go up, I guess, right? I got a package of nine large, I mean, these guys are, there's my hand, look at these muffins here. Um, banana, chocolate, and blueberry. This will be breakfast tomorrow for, on the way to church. And the first few days of the week, we'll have muffins for breakfast. I got two packs of Dr. Pepper. 36 in each pack for $14.22. I got two packages of the Gold Peak Tea for Brent. All right, now here's something I got. It's a little bit exciting for me. Brent got me a food saver for Christmas and I'm so excited I can't wait to use it. So I picked up a, an extra box of the um, sealing, the, the bags and the the rolls of plastic that you create your own bags. I got two rolls that are eight by eight inches by 20 feet, four rolls that are 11 inches wide and 16 feet long, and six one gallon bags for my food saver. I've never used it yet. Hopefully I will get to use it and do something creative with these with this meat I bought. Okay, it was time to buy trash bags again. This price has not gone up since I bought them last, $17.98. And on around the table here is a humongous package of the Members Mark toilet paper for, wow, who can read that number? Not me. <laughs> $21.75. I got Jiffy Corn Muffin Mix, big box, for $3.12. And I got two of those. Uh, Rayos homemade marinara sauce made in Italy, all natural, supposed to be very healthy choice, $7.98 for two. I didn't think that price was terrible. I got a box of, who 
Oh, I'm out of breath. Chef Boyardee beef ravioli, 12 cans for $12.62. I thought that was a great deal as well. So that's my haul, y'all. <laughs> and does it look like $330 worth? I don't think so. That's what we paid. All right. I will let you go and I will talk to you soon. Thanks for watching.